All right, here we go again. Another episode of Watch and Shoes. Which one does this go with? I think this goes with you just taking the box and carrying it. <laughs> that fire red and this orange red, lava red, uh, matches pretty well. I don't know about the watches matching the shoe. Definitely uh, uh, oh, any of the diver watches. The uh, Hydromax, the uh, now I'm, uh, Sea Hunter, and and possibly this one the uh, Venom possibly the Venom because uh, those go pretty deep underwater this is also a thousand meters that might make sense that might be about it though uh, this has got to be the rarest Nike in the world because I've not ever seen a person with this shoe on especially with respect to how many compliments I get from wearing this shoe. I went out with my cousin one time in Cleveland, Ohio, drinking. <laughs> and I told him before we left, we're going to get stopped several times because of this shoe. And sure enough, the very first bar before we even got inside, we were stopped on the outside. And the person wanted to know what the heck and when and how and where did I get this shoe. And how is it they've never seen it. But uh, this shoe is something you've actually seen. It's just... You've seen parts of it. This was the first time these were used, I believe. And the first time this fabric was used in a shoe to be the whole shoe, not just a hint or an accent of a shoe. This was the first time Nike used this, that sole on a shoe. This is the actual sole. That's why it's so low to the ground because you're shoe bottom I guess lunar lawn and this cut material which makes for extremely comfortable footstep as you can see there really comfortable when you're getting out of the water when you're in the water when you're I like to snorkel so when I'm standing on the uh, shallow coral not the deep coral I wouldn't stand on the deep coral but the uh, or just the rocks lava rocks uh, when you're getting in the ocean, the uh, this shoe helps you to keep from feeling any of those sharp points. And anytime you're around divers, they want to know how did you get that and where do you, where do they get them? Divers or snorkelers, because everybody has to worry about stepping on something that slices your foot. But this, I've stepped on plenty of things and they've sliced these. <laughs> these things have been around the world several times. Uh, on many different oceans or in many different oceans uh, on many different beaches and they just take a lick and they keep ticking also a good shoe to walk around a city in when you're traveling you definitely won't be hard to find uh, if you go missing <laughs> they stand out pretty 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 well but extremely comfortable it looks like you're wearing a sock and people often stop me and ask me is it a sock is that a Nike sock and I'm like, nah, it's actually a shoe. They just did a really good job of hiding the actual sole by using this insert as the, the, the shoe sole. Did a great job. I'm told that this shoe, um, every aspect of this shoe is used in current shoes. But this shoe was extremely expensive when it came out and didn't sell well. So, what, But Nike used a lot of research, uh, years worth of research into the shoe so when it came out and didn't sell well what Nike did is take aspects of the shoe uh, the fabric these um, fly wires I think they're called uh, they've taken all kind of different aspects of the shoe and put it into a bunch of different shoes so this is how you get all of that technology in one you go out and buy this shoe which is called the hyper feel Nike free hyper feel if you want all of that in one, and you will feel it because it's extremely comfortable, uh, there it is. But if you want to break it up and get 25 different shoes with one single piece of technology from this shoe, that's another alternative way to get it. But I'm putting it out there that this might be the most rare Nike shoe on the planet, only because I've not ever seen another human being with this shoe on. Uh, <clears throat> all right, we're going to keep them going. Uh, nice and simple that shoe goes with the whole box closed 
This has been another episode of Watching Shoes. Watch in Shoes. Thank you for watching.